welcome to my channel. Today we are going to learn about react.lazy function. Before we start, let's understand what is code splitting. Code splitting is a technique to split your code into multiple bundles so that you can load them on demand. It is used to reduce the size of the initial bundle and to improve the performance of the application. In this video, we will see how we can use code splitting in React. Let's understand this with an example. A good place to start is with roots. I've created a simple React application. In this application, I have added two roots. One is for the home page and the other is for the about page. I have created a component called home and about. I have imported these components into the app.js file. I have also added the roots for these components in the app.js file. When we go with the traditional approach, we have to load both components before rendering them, it will take extra time to load all components, even though we are not showing the component. This is where the code splitting comes into the picture. We get multiple benefits by using React.lazy. 1. It helps to load the components on demand. 2. It helps to reduce the size of the initial bundle. 3. It helps to improve the performance of the application. Let's see how we can use React.lazy. To use code splitting in React, we need to use React.lazy function. React.lazy is a function that lets you render a dynamic import as a regular component. It takes a function that must call a dynamic import. This must return a promise which resolves to a module with a default export containing a React component. We can use React.lazy to load the components asynchronously. So when we are visiting the home page, the browser will only load the home component and when we are visiting the about page, the browser will load the about component. This will help to reduce the size of the initial bundle and improve the performance of the application. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more videos. I will see you in the next video.